Okay, cats, it's dad. It is uh, Wednesday. Uh, last night went to Madeline's uh, band slash choir slash show choir slash jazz band uh, concert at Little Shoot. Had a, uh, to be fair, I had kind of a cruddy attitude going into it just, just because how long it was. I think it was like, man, an hour and a half. Um, you know, coming right from work, going there, but got myself a nice, nice, nice sandwich and had a uh, pretty great, great experience. I was watching the uh, the band uh, and just watching all the the different um, different performances and kind of noticed a couple things. First thing I noticed is that boy, everybody is kind of in it together, um, meaning you know all the band people or all the choir pe all the choir people and the band people are the same people who are in the plays who are in the show choir. And, you know, the, the top people at uh, at the state solo ensemble are, the, uh, are, you know, just some of the best people in the in their in their productions and the dancers. And it was all very, very tight-knit group, and it's neat to see Madeline a part of that. Um, there's a lot of seniors that are going to be retiring this year or moving on to college, and a lot of spots open up for Madeline in her performance uh, career, if that's what she uh, wants to do, which is... Uh, kind of, uh, kind of neat. Um, it uh, got a little, uh, you know, emotional watching Madeline play trumpet and thinking about uh, her great grandfather, uh, Grandpa Grillo, uh, who also played trumpet. Uh, Grandpa Grillo had his own big band, the Andy Grillo Band, and he was the uh, uh, leader of the band, and he played trumpet. And uh, just thinking about, uh, I remember coming home from school many days, and Grandpa's car was there, of course, so excited. And he had this green travel bag, and I got to always carry the, uh, the green bag into the house. And then uh, uh, you would always hear him sitting in, one of the chairs in the living room playing trumpet and whether it be the scales or his thing and you know the trumpet playing kept him young um he was he was a smoker and uh and but he played trumpet and he golfed and when he was 80 years old he won a trophy from the country club uh that he golfed lower than his age which was pretty amazing so the sound of the trumpet, I grew up to. I always grew up to, and that was amazing. Uh, so hearing that last night just made me think about how proud um, Grandpa is looking down on you. I'm sorry. It's neat to be a part of that and to watch you perform and to watch you in your element. Um, it's neat. neat to watch you sprout and to watch you do what you love to do with your friends and uh, to watch you perform. It makes you happy. And it certainly made me happy to watch it, watch it take place. I'm going to have a drink of this diet soda. A lot of good things going on. Found out I'm getting a new boss today. I don't know. I don't know. They just don't know what to do with me or something. But so I'm getting a new boss. Kind of fun. Um, and tonight I'm going to an industry <clears throat> gathering, which is totally cool. Never been a part of anything like that before. Uh, Going to learn and grow and meet some new people tonight, which is totally fun. Um, at the Sales and Marketing Professionals, SMP. How cool is that? Mal and I love you. Clara, I love you. Uh, Emma, I love you. Uh, I love you, Tommy, and I love you, Baby Drew. You're going to be one on Saturday, Baby Drew, and we're so excited. I love you so, so, so very much. Uh, take care, kids. Peace out. Bye.